building site is a, is, is a very good testing ground for, for our technology. As we know, there are high concentration of manual laborers on the site. Uh, because of their profession, they tend to have dry skin or damaged fingerprint skin. Um, the fact that we have uh, managed to install uh, around 10 sites in the UK and both the customer and the installer are very happy with our system proves our claim that the system doesn't, does not only work in a lab, in lab environment but also work in a real, real life scenario. My role is to install access control systems on building sites for the purposes of safety and in this particular instance we've got a biometric system. Although there are biometric systems available this is the first time we've used a fingerprint system. There are three main advantages to this technology. Firstly, it's this aspect of safety. It's a true safety system. It recognises who's gone through and records that and gives us the accuracy of who is on site at any one time. And secondly, the efficiency of doing that. The efficiency of how quick can it read the finger and let you through that turnstile. You can't have a queue of people in the morning when you've got 200 workers queuing to get through. Third important factor is the cost. We've brought the cost down to a, a, a price that the sites are prepared to pay rather than it's trying to sell them clever technology at a high price. This is a high technology product at a reasonable price. One of the issues with, with fingerprint uh, recognition is because every time you present your finger, uh, finger to the scanner, uh, because of the angle, because of the pressure you apply to, to, the, uh, to the scanning surface, it creates distortion. And that's part of the reason for failure. And our unwarping technology will address this issue directly. Uh, we'll apply a mathematical model on the fingerprint uh, to form a normalized fingerprint uh, representation um, so it won't be affected by various distortion. I'm an installer and for me I'm looking at the marketplace to see which is the best product and as an expert in access control generally I know that this technology is good. I've looked at all the biometric systems and honestly when I first saw it I knew it had a task. It had to work on a building site with dirty hands and so far it's working. We've done all the tests, all the trials. I'm convinced that this is a major move forward on-site access control safety. For building site the most important issue is health and safety uh, so for the site manager to have an idea of who is on site at any given time uh, for health and safety reasons. So a system will be able to pr provide a very accurate report at any given time to who is on site and which contractor and which employee is on site so if there is a security issue or emergency uh, scenario then they, uh, they will have a better idea. Well, we design a core matching algorithm. We use a very innovative approach uh, to tackle the accuracy problem with fingerprint recognition. Um, we have special advantage over the existing system on dealing with low quality print. Um, low quality prints being distorted prints, um, people with uh, dry skin, uh, scar tissues and scratches etc. Um, a certain population of people with certain professions, they tend to have damaged fingerprints, uh, produce very low quality print. So our system are much better in dealing with those, those uh, uh, examples than, than any other in the market. The, the construction industry generally is interested in biometrics. It's a bit of a fashion because they can see the advantages and honestly it's a difficult process of saying that this is any better until by example they see for themselves because there have been difficulties with biometrics the fact that the hand key handprint system which is the recognized I wouldn't say industry standard but it's a recognized system has been slow it's verification it's pin number entry followed by the hand this is simply finger on read the finger and straight through what could be more simple fingerprint technology has been around for a long time uh, but for a long time it has always been used for uh, criminal detection of forensic applications. After September 11, fingerprint technology are more and more popular in civil applications, access control, uh, border control, uh, national ID card, etc. Et the first couple of years of the, um, of the company formation, we started at the computer science department. We ran our lab test uh, at the computer science department. Um, tested on our colleagues and, and friends 
and obviously we tend to have a, a better quality fingerprint than uh, than some other people's. Uh, this is a this is a real life uh, test for us. Uh, workers are like it. They don't have to do. Uh, remember to bring their card, they don't have to remember the PIN number, they can just turn, uh, turn up to work and use their fingerprint. The systems are fast, accurate and responsive.